वेलकम फ्रेंड्स दिस इज डॉक्टर प्रशांत पटेल जैन कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग बेलगाम प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल गिव द कमेंट्स आल्सो डोंट फॉरगेट टू हिट द लाइक बटन इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू कॉल एग्जांपल्स ऑन लैपलास ट्रांसफॉर्म्स यूजिंग द प्रॉपर्टी टी टू द पावर एन इनटू एफ ऑफ टी टू ट्रांसफॉर्म एज अ यंत डेरिवेटिव एंड आई एम सॉल्विंग द प्रॉब्लम इन Laplace transform of a t to the power n into f of t. If this f of t is multiplied with the t to the power n, then its a transformation is going to take place as a derivative of a Laplace transform of f of t. It is a minus one to the power n into nth derivative with respect to s. Okay, this n is a word I am going to use into Laplace transform of f of t. Okay, you have to find out the Laplace transform of f of t, and you have to differentiate that n times. Or also, I can write it as minus one to the power n into nth derivative of nth derivative with respect to s of capital F of s, where capital F of s is the Laplace transform of f of t. Okay. In particular, if n is equal to one, then what happens? Laplace transform of t into f of t. If t is n is equal to one here, then minus one to the power one, minus first derivative with respect to s of Laplace transform of f of t will become. Okay. Then in particular, Laplace transform of t square. f of t if it is there then its formula will become minus 1 to the power 2 that is minus square will become plus 1 into second derivative plus with respect to s square laplace transform of f of t it will become okay using this properties some examples i am going to solve here laplace transform of a T into sine et. I have to find out. T is multiplied with the sine et. Separate Laplace transform of t. I can find out sine et. I can find out. But it is a product. If addition is there, addition or subtraction in between is there, then separate Laplace transform I could have calculated. But here product. That's why I am going to apply this property now. Okay, which I can write it as a. It's Laplace transform as a first formula minus d by ds of first derivative. Of Laplace transform of sine at because sine at is my f of t comparing with this, which is equal to minus d by ds of Laplace transform of sine at is nothing but a divided by s square plus a square. This one I have to differentiate with respect to s. Okay, to differentiate this directly also you can write or to avoid the confusion. Okay, I will use the u by v rule. That is minus into bracket denominator. We have square plus a square into differentiation of a is with respect to s is zero plus minus a into differentiation of s square plus a square with respect to s will become two s whole divided by s square plus a square the Square. There is u by v rule. I am applying here. Okay, which is equal to this will cancel, and it is minus of minus plus two a s divided by s square plus a square the whole square. For your reference, I will write u by v rule here. Derivative of u by v with respect to x only. I will write u by v is nothing but u into d v. Sorry, v into d u by dx minus v into it is okay u into dv by dx divided by v square okay then next example here my next example is find the laplace transform of t square into cos at again t square is multiplied with cos at therefore f of t is a cos at using this property now t square into f of t as a d square by ds okay that is a second order derivative of laplace transform of 
cos at correct which is equal to d square by ds square of laplace transform cos at is nothing but s divided by s square plus a square this one i have to differentiate two times okay now first derivative as it is that is a d by ds of one derivative again i will apply the u by v rule here s square plus a square into differentiation of s with respect to s will become 1 minus s into differentiation of s square plus a square is 2s plus a square is 0 therefore it is 2s whole divided by s square plus a square the square simplifying this again and then differentiating let me simplify this first that is d by ds of d by ds of s square plus a square minus 2s square whole divided by s square plus a square the square okay therefore i can write it as dy ds of dy ds of a square minus s square s square minus 2s square divided by s square plus a square the square this one i have to differentiate with respect to s again okay that is again i am applying the u by v rule here that is s square plus a square square into differentiation of a square minus s square 0 minus 2s minus a square minus s square into differentiation of denominator s square plus a square the square is there chain rule have to apply that is 2 times s square plus a square into differentiation of s square plus a square is 2s whole divided by whole divided by s square plus a square square is there already and it's a square okay let me simplify this and write it directly as in the two terms i can just observe there i am having the terms 2s 2s also here therefore 2s i am taking common as well as s square plus a square and s square plus a square i will take common s square plus a square if i am taking common then i am going to remain with minus of s square plus a square will remain one term one term i have taken common one term will remain and this is minus this is taken common this becomes minus two times a square minus s square whole divided by s square plus a square raised to square square will become four one of this term will go to cancel it will become q and final answer is next is minus s square minus a square and this is a minus 2a square minus of minus plus 2s square whole divided by s square plus a square raised to 3 okay last step i can simplify it as 2s into bracket 2s into bracket minus s square plus 2s square will become plus s square minus a square minus 2a square will become minus 3a square whole divided by s square plus a square cube this is the required answer like this some okay. more examples In my next here. example it is a t into e raised to minus t cos 2t okay here product of three terms is there i have to apply the both the properties previous two properties whatever t into so i can solve this one in two ways i can take t into this one i can treat it as f of t or e raised to minus t into t into f of t i can write simplest way i will select first okay then i will go for the second method also i will try to solve here that is i can write it as a laplace transform of e to the power minus t into 
t cos 2t okay i will treat this one as my f of t then using that first property of laplace transform that is if it is f of t is multiplied with e to the power minus t i can write it as a laplace transform of t into cos 2t and s is replaced by s plus 1 coefficient of is minus minus of minus plus 1 then i have to find out the laplace transform of t into cos 2t that i can write it as a t into cos t as minus d by ds of laplace transform of cos 2t okay in this final answer i have to replace s divided s is replaced by s plus 1 now i can differentiate i can find the laplace transform of cos 2t and differentiate it that is minus d by ds of laplace transform of cos 2t is s divided by s square plus 2 square 2 square is nothing but 4 and here s is replaced by s plus 1 finally i will replace s is replaced by s after taking the differentiation and all those things therefore its derivative i can take it as a minus as it is and it is a quotient rule i will apply s square plus 4 into differential of s is 1 minus s into differential of s square plus 2 square is 2s whole divided by s square plus 4 the square and in this s is replaced by s plus 1 that is nothing but simplifying this one okay that is uh, minus i will keep as it is and then s square minus 2 square will become Minus s square, therefore four minus s square whole divided by whole divided by uh, s square plus four the whole square, and in this s is replaced by s plus one. Therefore, my required answer is minus of minus. I can write it as plus, and s is replaced by s plus one. Therefore, s plus one of the whole square. s plus 1 the whole square minus 4 s is replaced by s plus 1 and in denominator also s is replaced by s plus 1 s plus 1 of the whole square plus 4 and it's a square okay i can simplify this one more step as expanding this s square plus 2ab that is 2s plus 1 square minus Four will become minus three divided by in the denominator also will expand s square plus two s plus one plus four that is pi square. This is the required answer. Another method also I will try to solve here and I'll, in my another method this same term I will keep as it is that is the Laplace transform of t into e to the power minus t cos 2t okay due to this t i and this one i am treating it as f of t first only applying the second property that is minus d by ds of laplace transform of e to the power minus t into cos 2t okay therefore minus d by ds of laplace transform of e to the power minus t cos 2t can be calculated as laplace transform of cos 2t and s is replaced by s plus 1 therefore minus d by ds of laplace transform of cos 2t is s divided by s square plus 4 and in this s is replaced by s plus 1 which is minus d by ds of s plus 1 divided by s plus 1 of the whole square plus 4 this one i have to differentiate okay before differentiation the denominator i will simplify and then differentiation minus d by ds of s plus 1 divided by s square plus 2s plus 1 plus 4 that is a 5 this one i have to differentiate with respect to s i am going to get it as a minus denominator first s square plus 2s plus 5 and then differential of s plus 1 is 1 minus s plus 1 into differential of denominator that is 2s plus 
whole divided by s square plus 2s plus pi and it's a square u by v rule again okay simplifying this i'm going to get it as a minus of minus of s square plus 2s plus pi minus s to this minus expanding this one s into 2s will become minus 2s square minus s into this minus 2s minus 1 into 2s will become minus 2s minus 1 into 2 will become minus 2 whole divided by s square plus 2s plus 5 square simplifying this what i am going to get let us see okay that is minus into bracket s square minus 2s square will become minus s square 2s minus 2s one of the two cancels again minus 2s 5 minus 2 will become plus 3 whole divided by s square plus 2s plus 5 the whole square both the answers are one and the same but applying the properties which one is first and which one is second next that is very important here okay you can select any one of them first but whichever is simple i feel first method is the simplest one okay i'm going for the next example here last example in this video that is find the laplace transform of t into sine square t again only t is multiplied here that is a laplace transform of uh, it will become minus d by ds of laplace transform of uh, sine square t okay then we have to different find the laplace transform of sine square t and then differentiate by the side for our convenience i will find the laplace transform of sine square t here to find the laplace transform of sine square t sine square t i can write it as 1 minus cos 2t divided by okay that is nothing but minus d by ds of laplace transform of 1 minus cos 2t divided by 2 it's laplace transform i have to find out minus d by ds of laplace transform 1 by 2 common outside laplace trans addition of terms laplace transform of 1 is 1 by s minus laplace transform of cos 2t is s divided by s square plus 2 square is this one I have to differentiate with respect to s yes. that I am going to get it as a minus 1 by 2 outside this 1 by 2 I am taking outside and a differentiation of 1 by s with respect to s is minus 1 by s square minus applying the quotient rule for this s square plus 4 into differentiation of s is 1 minus s into differentiation of s square plus 4 is 2s whole divided by s square plus 4 the square simplifying this once again i am going to get it as minus 1 by 2 into minus 1 by s square minus lcm is s square plus 4 the whole square and here s square minus 2s square will become minus s square therefore it is a 4 plus 4 minus s square okay simplifying this um, s square into s square plus 4 the whole square and it is a minus already taken common minus already taken common this will become s square plus 4 the whole square minus already taken common plus 4 minus s square this one i can simplify or can keep like this okay okay please subscribe my channel give the comments and so don't forget to hit the like button thank you friends